Oh, howdy! Welcome to the Tabaxi Cafe. Today, we're going to be going over one of my personal favorite drinks, the Double Spell Shout Mocha. Now, before we get started, I should warn that this drink comes with some interesting side effects. Now, unless you want to end up like her, ah! you should listen closely. So first, we're going to have a dark brooding roast espresso bean to begin with, to just really set the overall edgy theme of this class. But I think the drink's real strong suit is the crazy number of flavors it can come in. But today, we're going to follow my personal favorite subclass, the Great Hold One Warlock. Now, with the two espresso spell shots, we're going to add a spoon of arcane cocoa powder. I really like how this drink maximizes the espresso shots to make it different than all the other arcane drinks out there. And with a focus on the many types of cantrip coca and the multitude of flavors that they all bring, all leading up to the grand Eldritch Blast brand coca that everyone goes for. And I completely understand why. It's such a powerful flavor and when mixed with some evocation syrups can make for some crazy good combinations. Huh, <sighs> but I'm getting ahead of myself. Next, let's just add a small splash of heavy Great Old One whipping cream and set it up to foam. And while that's foaming, let's chat about what flavors of evocation we're going to add in. So there's a few that immediately come to mind, but feel free to use whatever flavor you want to have in your own drink. For what I'm going to use are the Five Faced Caramel Syrup, the Many Faced Cherry Syrup, and the Vanilla Moon Aspect Syrup to make a sweet punch of utility flavors. Alrighty, with all of our flavors picked out and the milk foamed, we're ready to do the final combination. Pour the milk into the arcane chocolate shots while using a spoon to gently mix. And then, with the foam, you can design the pact you want your mix to have. Here, we're going to use the Tome Square to maximize the moon aspect flavor. Now, we're going to combine our Eldritch beverage with our three evocations and mix the desired amount of sweet. And make sure not to add too much or things will go quite explosive, and trust me it has happened before and you don't want to clean up that mess. <laughs> How about we level this up from about a level 5 to a level 12, huh? All we're gonna need is some additional Great Old One Whipping Cream and a dash of some high-grade Mystic Arcanum Powder. But, because Arcanum Powder is banned in most states, that makes it a bit difficult for me to get my paws on it. But, there's a reason why I'm your favorite cafe. Add some sugar and additional Great Old One Whipping Cream into a bowl, mix it until it stops moving on its own, and just add that on top of our Double Spell Shot Polka and then sprinkle the eye bite arcanum powder on top and BAM! There you go. One twelfth level warlock mocha. Ready to drink. <sighs> well, I'd like to thank you all for stopping by the Tabaxi Cafe. And I hope you each enjoy your own Eldritch beverage at home. <laughs> Take care. Uh, Naomi, no, you can't have, you can't have any more. Go, get out of here.